Good morning. It's uh, about 6.20 a.m. on September the 5th. It is freezing. I cannot believe it was 35 degrees and screaming hot only a week or two ago in St. George. Here we have in Inverell. It was minus one yesterday morning and it's about four. I had a look. Now, let's see if Bob's up. Who's Bob? <laughs> I'm sure if there's any, any people that do those 24-hour marathons, they know who Bob is. Big orange ball. <laughs> anyway. Oh, I'm just going to put the phone out. <laughs> I'm freezing. I learned my lesson. I need coffee. <laughs> um, decided to hit... Uh, Ben, uh, I think it's called Bendemir. Then there's a gravel path that goes down to um, Barabba and then down to Gunnada, hopefully. But from Barabba, I can also get the Tambar Springs if I change my mind again. I'm pretty sure about going to um, Gunnada, though. I'm trying to hit towns that I've never been to before, even though I've lived in New South Wales all my life. Oh, God, I had a good sleep. Nearly 11 hours. Um, but he's all fixed. I'm all fixed. New day, new attitude. A um, little bit of gratitude. Gratitude doesn't mean walking around saying, you know, thank you for everything, and that is ice. Damn. <laughs> um, just come off my glove. <laughs> Look at me, thumbs so I can operate my phone. Um, gratitude takes you from what you lack to what you have. So it takes your mind off depletion and puts your mind into plenty. You know, I have a body that still works, I have enough food, enough money, and enough love in my life from my daughter and family that everything's going to be okay, even if it's not, you know. I can control the boat that I'm in, but not the water and the rocks on the bottom and the weather and the waves, so as long as I focus on the now and not the outcome, things should be good, <laughs> Uh it's hard not to focus on the outcome and try and put your mind in the now, but that's pretty much all I can control on. So that sound like a bit of a douche. <laughs> so peace, love and harmony. Um, I doubt very much that I'm going to have reception. I'm hitting, according to this website, this will be the third one on this trip, uh, one of those self-service caravan parks, so I'm hoping it is. It'd be nice to a little bit of gravel. Um, I think after this trip over summer, I'm going to try and build myself a road touring bike. Um, been watching one or two people that do it, and I don't know. I think maybe I've done enough gravel for a bit, and I'll save that for camping trips. But, ah, that's an outcome for another day. So, peace, love, and harmony. Oh, yeah. I'm ready to rock them up now. So, um, take it easy on yourself. And... Flats be damned. God, that was a rough day. <laughs> oh, dear. Bye, guys.